Today, Kevin and I have six cookies, six different flavors of cookies uh, to try for you. These are made in Hawaii. We're in Hawaii in our hotel room. Uh, so doing this review from Hawaii about Hawaii food. <coughs> These are from Diamond Bakery. They've been in business since 1921. Um, I have the, these are all with macadamia nut. So I have the brownie, the original, and the taro. And I have the guava, the pineapple, and the passion fruit, bulacoy. Yes. So we're going to start with the original. And um, sadly, I don't remember where I bought these. I probably bought them at an ABC store. <laughs> um, I'm, and I just like tore that open. I thought you bought that at the supermarket we went to at outlet stores. Um, yes, food, I did. Foodway. Speedway. No. No, not Speedway. Safeway. No. The one that, the, oh, the outlet stores was Safeway. Was Safeway. Yeah. So this is the original. It says try um, the original taro, lily koi, brownie, pineapple, and guava. Three cookies are 190 calories. www.diamondbakery.com. Mm. That has got the texture of a shortbread, mm -hmm. but it doesn't taste like a shortbread. Mm -mm. But it doesn't taste really nutty either. It's got a little bit of a nutty flavor, but it's not like a like macadamia nut. You know, I do it's, it's, get a nutty flavor. And but it's not overpowering though. No, it's different than, I don't, it says it's made with 100% real butter, which I believe. I think it's not as buttery as a shortbread. Right, yeah, and a little bit more nutty because of macadamia nut. So this next one is going to be the brownie. Mm, brownie. Mm, brownie. Yeah, and the brownie is 190 calories for three. Hawaiian shortbread macadamia brownie. Macadamia nut brownie. Hmm. It tastes a little like cocoa. I don't know if it tastes like brownie. I'm gonna be honest with you. I not really get much of anything. I think if I was blindfolded, I would have a hard time. Say so you, I don't think you would absolutely say, oh, that's not brownie or chocolate or anything like that. Unless you're looking at the box with the color and the color of the cookie, I really don't taste brownie at mm, all. No. It's not bad. It's not anything unpleasant. I think or... it might have a slight cocoa flavor, but only because I'm searching for it. Yeah, really, it, there's there's not a, a strong flavor to it at all. I don't know what the taro is. Isn't, this, that, this, isn't that that root? Yes, this is taro. I think we had some taro chips. We have had taro chips, yes. Three cookies, 190 calories. Yeah, we've had this flavor before. And this is a as a like a lavender tint mm -hmm. to it. Mm. I wasn't expecting it like that, but I do like it quite a bit. Oh, a crunchy bit in it. Yes, there's there's yes, it's like they added, it's like little bitty teeny tiny seeds or something. Mm -hmm. It's I don't think it is, but it's just. That's what it seems like. It's yeah. little crunchy pieces. Yeah, little, little flakes of something. Um, and I like that quite a bit too. Mm -hmm. That's almost as good as the first one. I'll, yes, I like this more than the brownie because I think it has more flavor. Yeah. yeah but I there's agree. nothing sharp or bitter or... Mm -hmm. No, that's, that's really it's good. It's really a nice, sweet cookie. Nice, sweet shortbread. This is the, what, pineapple? Pineapple. I thought that would be... A good one there. Yeah, sure. Pineapple. Hawaiian shortbread macadamia and that pineapple. 190 calories for three. I like pineapple anyway. They all look pretty much the same. I do too. It, it, you know, if you like uh, pineapple, then uh, Hawaii's the place for you. <laughs> I got a little texture of the macadamia nuts in that one. Wow. You really taste the pineapple. Mm -hmm. You would know that if you were blindfolded, mm -hmm. that's for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> mm. 
I like them quite a bit. And even though they have all said macadamia nut, that one has had more pieces of macadamia um, nut than any of them. Yeah. Yeah, it actually has, or at least the bite I got that we had, yeah. had the it's like, bigger hunks in there. Yeah, it's like diced macadamia nut. Mm -hmm. uh, so you get that texture with the pineapple flavor. Yeah, but I really like that one. That's probably mm -hmm. one of my favorites. Now, which one's your, the, the passion Let's fruit do or the, the guava? I've just been tearing that box open. <laughs> Pop it up. I'm putting some pieces, some shortbread over to the side so I can have a picture for the for you all at the end of the video. Some things I'll just warn you, some things that we've reviewed in the room, I have not taken a picture of at the end because it was just too difficult to do. But these I'll I'll try to get a picture. These are three cookies are 170 calories. And this is pink. Mm -hmm. and that tastes like a grapefruit or something. Mm -mm. No, no, like no, no, no. I know guava is a very popular flavor here too. Mm -hmm. um, matter of fact, someone even said uh, we were on a bus trip, and someone said, "Oh, are you ready to get some guava?" And people were like, "Yeah," and I'm like, "No." no. <laughs> I do not like that at all. Not even a little bit. It's, if you like grapefruity kind of flavor, I think you would like it. It tastes like, um, it tastes like you've been gnawing on an old sock. <laughs> it tastes like grapefruit to me. I don't like it. I don't like that don't. flavor at all. Now this is the Lily Koi, which is passion fruit. Three cookies are 190 calories. And uh, this could- all been open, easy to open except this one. This could go either way for this, uh, could be, might be good. Have we seen some guava ice cream here? Mm -hmm. Haven't we seen that in a, in ice cream too? Ice cream, candy, all kinds of stuff. It's better. That if, is much better than I, the guava. If I hadn't had the guava first though, I wouldn't like that at you, all. You wouldn't have appreciated it. I wouldn't like that. But now you appreciate how good it is because you had the guava. Yeah, because it's not really much better than the guava. The guava made you realize how good that, that lily but, is. But like I said, that passion fruit for me is just slightly better than the guava, not, not greatly. I like it a lot better because I really, really don't like that guava at all. Um, I got a bigger heat piece of the macadamia nuts in those last two as well. Okay, we tried six. If you had to pick two. Uh, the pineapple and the original, probably. That's mine. Yeah. That's, what was this one? The taro was good, too. The taro was good, too. So if I had to pick a third, that would be my third. Um, um, but I like the, really, really, really like the pineapple. It's my first. And then the original one just has a really good nutty flavor. And, and then, then the, the taro. And then the taro. I Although, I, though I could put the taro second, really. I'm gonna say the pineapple and then original and then yeah, taro. Yeah, I think I'll stick with that too, but I, it, the taro and the original are pretty close, so. So these were the, the six flavors that we found, um, and they have these uh, six flavors on the back. So I don't know if they do like special editions of these with the macadamia nut, then we just didn't see them. Um, but you know, if you know about them, you can uh, let us know. And if you see these, um, at your grocery stores, if you are not in Hawaii, if you're in a, just a grocery store in California or someplace like that, let us know because I always think that's interesting because this is not something that we would see in Kentucky at no, all. No, not, most of these flavors we wouldn't see in Kentucky no, either. we wouldn't. So I will try to get a good picture for you all for uh, the end of the video and thanks for watching.